along and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can tell from today's title, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for my 16th birthday. This video is in no way to brag about what I got, it's simply to show you guys what I got for my birthday. I'm really excited. So initially I wasn't going to film this video, one, because I didn't know if people would actually want to see it because I know some people really just don't care. But then I decided, no, I'm going to film it because it's a memory and that way when I'm like 30 I can go back and look on this, look how good I looked, you know, what I got for my birthday or whatever. But um. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Without further ado, let's just get right into this video. So here is the bag. Oh, it's heavy. That all of my, can y'all see how big this bag is? This is the bag that all my birthday stuff is in. So my parents got me that bag when they gave me my stuff and then other people gave me things. So I put them in there and we're just going to get started. So first I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I got myself. So the first thing is this little miniature tripod right here. I got this for whenever, you know, I start driving and because I'm going to be doing some car videos and I thought this could just sit on my dashboard holding my camera. Hopefully it works out and even if it doesn't work for my camera, I can still use it for my phone when I want to take, you know, Instagram pictures or something. The next thing I got for myself are these little earrings right here. I got these at Five Below. I love getting earrings from there because they're cheap and they have some really cute ones. Can y'all see? So it's like hoops and it's three pairs of studs. There was another set of hoops here, but I think I wore them. And I, I simply do not know where they are. Like if you ask me, I couldn't tell you because I don't know where they are. But I probably should find them. No, you're right. Eh, maybe. The next thing I got for myself is this little two-piece makeup brush cleaning kit. So I have a habit of not cleaning my makeup brushes after I use them because I don't wear makeup that often. So I forget that I actually do need to clean them after. My sister told me I should actually just clean them after I use them because I'm a person that forgets to clean them than when I want to use them again. I want to use purple, but there's like pink on a brush, and that's a whole... That's a whole dilemma. So let me show you guys what it looks like. So it's like a little hand thing. I think you put your hands in here. This is how I did it. And like I held it and then you poured this little solution they have. It kind of is like a little shampoo for the brush. And then you pour it on here, put water on that. And then I got my brush and I would just rub the brush on there. It actually works pretty well. And I think I got it for like $4 at my local beauty supply store. So that's not bad at all. The next thing I got for myself are these body butters right here. So I got them from this company on Etsy called My Beloved Crown. So I saw them one day and they just look really pretty and I kind of impulsively bought them but I'm glad I did because they smell really good. Look at this one. This one is the Sugar Dream one. Look at how pretty that is. Can Y'all Y'all can't even see it. I'm sorry. But it's really pretty and I got this for like $3. It was either 3 or $4. Because she was having a sale in her shop and I was like, why not? This is like the miniature jar. This is the 2 ounce, but I know she makes an 8 ounce jar too. But yeah, I've been using these and I don't use them every day because I don't want to run out. But I've been using them and they work pretty well. They smell good and they moisturize really well. So I would definitely recommend these if you guys want to, you know, go like check out her shop. It's called My Beloved Crown. I'll probably link, in the, I'll probably link it in the description for you guys so you can know exactly where it is all right you guys that's everything that i got myself so now we're going to move on to what other people gave me so the first thing i'm going to show you guys is what my sister got me so first off she got me something that i wanted i think i i mentioned it in what i want for my birthday video she got me ariana grande's new perfume look at that look at that look at that when I tell y'all, I was so, so I actually, look at how good that looks, y'all. I was so excited. Let me show you guys what it looks like. I put it back in the box just for the purpose of this video. But you guys, when I tell you, I was so surprised when she got this for me because we were actually in the store where I'm about to show you the other stuff she got for me. But we were like in Ulta and I was looking at it and she was like, oh, do you like like that or something? And I said, oh yeah, I'm going to ask mom to give me this for Christmas. And she was like, if you want it, get it. And I was like, for real? And she was like, yeah, because it was like all of Ariana Grande's perfumes on display. And she was like, okay, pick whichever one you want. And I already have Cloud, I have Moonlight, and I have Sweet Like Candy. I don't have Thank You Next. I actually smelled it in the store. It smells a little bit, I like the scent, but it's like super, super sweet. So I decided for right now just to pick this one. And I'm so glad I did because it smells immaculate. And look at the jar. Like, look at the holder. Look at the bottle. They can never... I got never! And it smells so good, y'all. When I tell y'all, mm, that's immaculate right there. It really is. That's my favorite word. I think I started using that because I heard it on TikTok. 
like a while back and I just use that word all the time now and I just do. Alright you guys, so the next couple of things my sister got me were from Sephora and Ulta. So here we are. I don't know where the Ulta bag is. I think I threw it away because like after we got them, she came to my house and did my makeup for me. But yeah, so I'm just going to show you guys. So the first thing she got me from Ulta is this little palette right here. This is the Nubian palette by Juvia's. If you don't know what Juvia's is, um, it's basically this really good brand for black girls um, in general because they cater to dark skinned black girls and they also cater to the variety of colors throughout our beautiful melanin skin and I have one of their other palettes actually I've used it in one of my past videos I can't remember the name of it but it's like a rainbow palette but this is the Nubian palette it is so pretty look at that oh drop the plastic but here's what the colors look like they're so pretty so neutral so I can use these a lot I'm one of those people who likes to do like really crazy makeup but I never wear it out I just wear it in the house but this is the perfect palette for me because it's something I can use like every day if I did my makeup every day but I don't so the next thing my sister got me is this really nice beauty blender right here this is like a real beauty blender I have never had a real one before because I just buy like the cheap ones but when I tell y'all this thing works so well like I was a little bit shocked because I was doing my makeup and I'm used to like my foundation like not going well but this like really did not I was like oh I really gotta practice now because now I really got like a real brush to do it next thing my sister bought for me is this Maybelline mascara right here so this one is from the falsies volume express so basically when you put it on it makes it look like you have eyelashes on I personally have like long eyelashes so I don't normally wear lashes and lashes are hard to put on so I got this and when I tell y'all this works so well y'all like it makes my eyelashes like come out to here they're already pretty long I don't know if you guys can like you probably can't see them but they're pretty long already so yeah this works really well the next thing that she bought for me is this Anastasia's Beverly Hills eye primer it works really well I like the consistency of it because it's liquidy one she had given me a MAC primer before and I liked it but as I mentioned in one of my other videos the only thing I didn't like about it is like it dries really quick on your eye but this doesn't and it works really nicely the next thing my sister bought me is a Fenty foundation and concealer. When I tell you, I was shocked because I've never had any, I've never had really expensive makeup because I always buy like cheap stuff. But when I tell you, oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That's Fenty. It's already kind of dirty because I used it already. Like my sister did my makeup for me. But when I tell y'all, this stuff is so good. It really is. So if anyone has the same kind of skin tone as me and you're wondering what foundation shade I am. So foundation, this is 450. And then for concealer, this is 445. So I'll open the concealer up and show you guys because I just realized I didn't do that yet. But here's what the concealer looks like. So pretty. I've only practiced with these maybe like twice so far because I've just been so busy recently. I haven't even had time to just sit down and do my makeup. But yeah. And the last thing my sister got for me is this little e.l.f. eyebrow gel, but it's clear. I wanted to get clear because I'm not good at doing my eyebrows yet, so I just wanted to have something clear that I could just, you know, slap on them instead of it being black, because then if I make a mistake, you can see it. And then I have another one in here, but that's just because my sister bought two, one for me, one for her, and she accidentally left it in the bag, so I'm just going to give it to her the next time I see her. But yeah, that's everything my sister got me for my birthday. Okay, guys, now I'm going to show you guys what my friend Stephanie got me for my birthday. So the first thing is this little thing right here. This is what I was talking about. If you watched my birthday wishlist video, I was talking about how I wanted this. Because when you stick it on the back of your car, it looks like a wind-up toy. And I thought that was so cute. I actually... I actually mentioned this to her like a couple months ago, but I didn't know if she was paying attention because I kind of said it and she didn't really respond. So I didn't know if she was paying attention to me or not, but she was, you guys. She was listening. Then the other thing she gave me is this little music note keychain right here. Oh, it was backwards. Here's a little music note keychain that she got me. It is really pretty. I love it so much. She got it for me to put on my car key because I told her I didn't have one. And my dad kept confusing my key with another key in my house because they have the same keychain. So I was like, wow, you did listen. You're so thoughtful. <laughs> the next thing I have to show you guys is this bag of candy right here. I actually got this from one of the security guards. 
Actually, the next thing I have to show you guys is this bag of candy right here. I actually got this from the security guard that works at my school. There was a lot more candy in here, like maybe like six more suckers, but I've been eating them. So yeah, thanks Officer G, shout out to you. Now I'm gonna show you guys what my mom and my dad got me for my birthday. So the first thing I got for my parents for my birthday was this yoga mat right here. So I've been exercising, well, at least when I got this, I had been exercising. I haven't been doing much recently, but I and but I had been exercising and we saw this in the store and my mom was like, if you want it, I'll get it for you, like another birthday present. And I was like, okay, cool. So I got it, works really well. The colors on it are beautiful too. The next thing I got are these lip glosses right here. So I'm a little bit disappointed and I'm going to tell you guys why. I'm not going to say the company name just because I don't want my opinion to affect y'all's opinion of them. But should I tell y'all the company name? I'm just going to show you. So there's this company I follow called Juicy Chic on Instagram. And I have been obsessed with their glosses for a while and I really wanted to get one. But then I ordered them. Like my mom got them for me for birthday present and they came in the mail. And it wasn't what I was expecting. So as you guys can tell, I have like all these different other glosses here the clear gloss worked really really well but these other glosses I just didn't like them because like I got a pink gloss and I got a red gloss and I got a brown gloss and they all just look clear on my lips like here's the pink one right here like if I open it I'm gonna show you guys look it goes on pink then it's just like it's basically just clear like it's not it's not pigmented as much as I thought it would be, so I was a little bit disappointed. But I would say it is still a good gloss if you like that. Like, if you just want to buy a colorful gloss, it's not actually the color. But I actually am still following her, and, like, she was talking about how she's rebranding because she didn't like how it was before, so I'm... We're going to see what happens, you guys. I'm excited. So, yeah. The next item that my parents got me was this really beautiful robe right here. When I tell you guys, this thing is so pretty and it's so soft, y'all. Like, I can't even. I wish y'all could feel it through the screen, honestly. The next thing I got is this little setting powder right here. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Powder. My mom actually bought this for me, like, the day before my birthday because I was like practicing doing my makeup so thank you mom the next thing my parents got me is this pair of airpods when I tell y'all I was so excited because I've been wanting a pair of airpods for so long they're not in the box right now they're actually charging so I'm just showing you guys the box but I'm so excited because they work so well and I love them so much I can't believe I ever lived without them honestly to be completely honest with y'all Okay, you guys, I don't know if you could tell, but, like, my camera kind of cut off for a second because my memory card got full. So I had to clean it off real quick and so I could get some more, you know, time in. So hopefully you couldn't tell, but I just told you anyway. So, anyways, the next thing I got is this. Ariana Grande's album on CD. And you best believe that the day since I got it, I've been jamming out to it in my car. POV. 3435. Positions. Just stream the album, people. What are you waiting for? Like, and then look, first of all, she looks gorgeous, as normal, as usual. But then, let's open it up. Look at how, look at how pretty that is. Look at how pretty that is. And I don't know if you guys do, but you know how this little directory thing, I never look at this, but when you look at it, there's so many pretty pictures of her in here. Like, oh my god. If I ever became like a famous singer or something and I could collab with someone, Ariana Grande would be like at the top of my list. Idolize her, love her, live for her music. You know, it's. It's really it's really a whole obsession but in a good way in a healthy way you know all right moving on to the next thing so the next thing I got are some sweatsuits so the first one is this one right here here's the pants it is super cute and it looks really good on my skin here's the bottoms and then here's the top it's like a little crop top kind of thing here's what it looks like yes yes and it comes down like this I actually haven't worn this out yet but it is really cute because I've tried it on. So, the next one I got is another sweatsuit. I really like this one. I would say it's not flattering, but it is very comfortable. So, here's what it looks like. I love the orange color, first of all. Here's the pants. They're just like, you know, basic sweatpants. And then here is the little top. It is so cute. Look at that. Look at the pocket. That is so cute, you guys. All right, you guys. The next thing my parents got me is this really cute top right here. I haven't worn it yet, but it is super cute. And it has a little fuzzy hoodie in it, which I love. I love the little print on it. You know, it just says believe. Gives me 
gives me Christmas and chill vibes, if you know what I'm saying. The next thing that got me is this little top right here. It has Friends on it because they know one of my favorite shows is Friends. If you haven't seen Friends at this point, like, what's the issue? Like, I, I really don't get it. If you haven't seen it by now, people, come on, y'all. Get yourselves together. The next thing my parents got me is this pair of corduroy pants right here. It's open because I think I tried these on. Yeah, but they got these for me. It's one of those pants that have like the little buttons, like three sets. I actually like pants like this because they like suck you in and make you look super snatched, which we love, you guys. The next thing they got me is all these pairs of fuzzy socks. It's like six pairs. I love this because you can never get enough fuzzy socks. And it's like they grow legs and walk away every year when I buy them. So I really love these. And they got me these little bracelets right here. They just say, I'm brave, I'm strong, I am unique. I am love these really cute little bracelets. Can y'all see them? Hopefully. Every time I say, can y'all see it, I think you can't. But then when I watch the recording, I just make myself look stupid because y'all can see it. But to me, I just can't see that y'all can see it. Oh! Text message. My parents also got me this really nice card right here. It's in here. It has my name on it. Here's what the card looks like if you guys just wanted to, you know, see it. I'm not going to tell you guys what's in it, but... You get to see it. And then my Aunt Daisy also sent me a card. Yes, I have an aunt that's name is Daisy. This is what the card looks like. It is so cute. She actually has the same birthday as me, so we always send each other gifts on our birthday. And she is so sweet. I love her so much. The last thing I got for my birthday was a thrift trip. So my parents took me to my favorite thrift store like the weekend before, like the Sunday before my actual birthday. Because, you know, I couldn't celebrate on my birthday because it's on a Tuesday. And I bought so much stuff, you guys. That's why I'm not including it in this video because I got so many things that are so cute. They deserve their own video. And that's what I'm going to do. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope I didn't talk too much. I normally do. So sorry. But... That's just kind of how I roll. I I got word vomit. That's just that's kind of how it goes. But that's it for today's video. I love you guys so much and thanks for watching. If you aren't already subscribed, you aren't already a Lexoid, what are you doing? Hit that big red subscribe button and become a Lexoid because I love to have you. And I'm sure the other Lexoids love to have you guys as well. I love you guys so much and thanks for watching. Bye, Lexoids! <laughs>